What's going on guys? So today I'm going to have a quick unboxing video for you. Um, you may notice I'm wearing my Matt's Off-Road Recovery hat. It has uh, quickly become one of my favorite channels on YouTube. I'm a little le late to the game finding it, but um, that's all and well. So I, being, you know, a Jeep owner and doing a lot of off-roading, I have a lot of recovery gear, but one thing I haven't bought yet is a recovery rope, or like a kinetic rope, or, or a snatch strap. Um, been looking at them online for a while, and I uh, just wasn't completely sure I wanted to invest in one. But I, after being introduced to Matt's channel and seeing just what he does with the, the kinetic ropes, I, I figured, oh, well, there we go. It's exactly the one I want. So I ordered me a hat and Matt's off-road recovery rope. So that is what we are going to unbox today. So let's check it out. All right. So this, this cool sticker will be going on my toolbox. This came with the hat. And there, or there might be another one in here. We'll see. But let's uh, go ahead and pop this guy open. Check that out. It's got a nice, oh man, that is a really nice bag. Matt's Recovery Rope by Yankum Lewis. Some stuff right here. All right. Just a little warning on how to use the rope. Well, that's cool. I will definitely have to do some tagging if I use this. Uh, planning to go to the beach tomorrow, Fort Fisher, so maybe uh, get some use out of that. If we get anybody stuck in the sand, like I got that raptor stuck. That's a cool another sticker to go on the toolbox. I'm not a fan of putting uh, stickers or decals on my vehicles, but I love decorating my toolbox, so those will find a home. Alright, man, so you can't tell this in this video, but this, this bag is just real uh, thick. It doesn't feel like a flimsy little uh, drawstring bag that you would normally have, so that's pretty cool that they give you that. Oh, bear with me, I didn't feel like setting up a tripod. Man, check that out. That thing is huge. This is the 30 foot 7 8 diameter rope. Let's see if I can cut this without cutting anything or me or. been a little easier with two hands oh, wow. so let's see where's the other end each end has this uh, little protective uh, material on it to whatever you're gonna be strapping it to and then in the middle, you have this nice little uh, sheath. If there's going to be any spots that it's going to rub on, just a little protective sheath. Man. I don't really have a good place to put this in the Jeep, so I'll probably just end up throwing it in the back whenever we go off-roading or go to the beach or whatever. And if my Ram TRX ever gets built, ordered it in November, if we ever get that, you know, I go to the beach, I'll take this guy with me. You never know when you 
might need to pull somebody out or have somebody pull you out so this is awesome oh i was about to say i thought this was supposed to come with a uh, soft shackle here it is all right and i have a few nice soft shackles i have a uh, Factory 55 uh, soft shack when I have a Bubba rope uh, gator jaw as well that I really like. But this should make a nice addition. And this I'll just throw in the back in my XG cargo bags with my other soft shackles. Boy, this is easier said than done with one hand. That's, uh, that's really nice. Working load limit, 8,700 pounds. And this one has a, a sheath on it just about all the way to help protect from rubbing and fraying and whatnot. That is awesome. Altogether, I want to say this was 360-ish. Which is a lot, but, I mean, you've seen what Matt does with these things in his videos. This will last me forever. Um, I guess unless I run over it and tear it up or something. But, anyway, this is awesome to have it, uh, with your recovery gear. Oh, man. Well, anyway, that is what you get with the Matt's Off-Road Recovery Bundle. Once again, like I said, love the channel. If you haven't been there, which, I mean, I find it hard to believe you haven't seen his channel, uh, go check it out. It's awesome. And, uh, anyway, thanks for watching. Maybe we'll get to see this in use sometime. Have a good one.